hello friends we are going to le city and uh, we have just crossed thanglangla pass and uh, in this video i am going to show you two wild animals and they are mammals uh, as they are wild animals so they are not domesticated uh, first of all i will show you a wild ass of uh, Ladakh region we we just going to stop our car uh, right here and uh, on my right side there is a herd of uh, wild ass um, they are probably I think they are five in number and uh, they are wild animals of Ladakh region they are known as Kyang uh, scientific name is equals Kyang and they are native to Tibetan plateau so uh, its current range is restricted to Ladakh in Jammu and Kashmir plains of the Tibetan plateau and uh, Nadran Nepal along the Tibetan border so other names uh, are Tibetan wild ass, Kyang, Gorkhar. Point of conservation they are least concerned as their population is good in Ladakh region. Uh, they are different from wild ass of Gujarat as they are different species. Wild ass of Gujarat is equus hemionus khur and uh, that is nearly threatened species and uh, these are equus Kyang. So they can be crossbred with uh, crossbred with uh, horses, donkeys, uh, and other zebras in captivity. There are three species of kyangs are currently recognized. Equus kyang kyang that is from Western kyang that is known as Western kyang from Tibet and Ladakh region, and uh, Equus kyang holdreri that's an Eastern kyang of Shanghai. Eastern Kyang Poly or Dawn as a Southern Kyang of Southern Tibet. Kyang can live uh, for up to 20 years in wild, so every year they produce a fowl mm, and every year they produce a single fowl, and that's how they are surviving in this cold region. And uh, on the way, I will show you a uh, um, blue sheep of Tibet. I will show you a blue sheep of Himalaya. Friends, we are going to stop our car because uh, we just saw the heard of uh, wild blue sheep uh, that just cross a road uh, from left to right and uh, climb and climb uh, up hills maybe we will see more of their family members so we are going to stop our car there We have to wait there to see their family members lagging just behind them. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, no, look, there is one more, uh, two. They are blue sheep of Himalaya. They are just crossing from there to the other side of the hill for grass. Uh, they are four in number. And uh, actually they are five in number. And before this they were 
so they are just crossing the road for the search of food uh, there is a small child of sheep this is a bra this is a brawl or a himalayan blue sheep uh, or nor that's a sudois nayor is a caprid found in the himalayas of india nepal bhutan tibet and pakistan its native names include bharal bharhal bharar bharut in hindi nas or sana na or sna in ladakh nabo in spitian nor in nepali and uh, many other names are present regarding the himalayan blue sheep they are generally least concern regarding the conservation status their population is good in himalaya so they are least concern uh, regarding the conservation status but uh, they have main problems uh, for their population uh, as they are posed for meat and uh, they have a competition with uh, domesticated sheep for the for grazing purposes for the food purposes so they are also protected by some monasteries uh, of uh, buddhism but uh, due to but due to the feeding